Welcome back to this new video of online media. Today, let's show you how to withdraw money from your Coinbase wallet directly into your banking account. This process is straightforward and ensures you can easily access your funds when you actually need it. So what you want to do first of all is to sign into your Coinbase wallet. Just in case you don't have an actual Coinbase wallet, you need to download directly here into Coinbase.com, the fast forward slash wallet, and here choose the option that says download. In my case, it seems I am not using using an iOS or Android, what I'm going to be doing here is to download out this as an extension from my Chrome Web Store. So I choose this option and I sign into my Coinbase. Now the part here is to navigate directly into your assets. But before you navigate directly into your assets, what you want to do is to make sure that you have an actual wallet connected. If you don't, you have to worry about that. It's going to be asking you to create one totally for free. And after that, what you can do, of course, is to um, import your recovery phrase, save your recovery phrase, and you're actually inside the Coinbase wallet. Now, what you want to do is to navigate directly into your assets. Here into your assets, let's focus into the cryptos. Now here into cryptos, what I wanted to do is to make sure that I have converted my cryptocurrency into fiat. Fiat is the actual process where I can trade the section, select the cryptos where I wanted to sell, of course, and change it into a fiat currency, for example, USD, uh, MXN, um, and so much more. So I choose here this option. And as you can see, we do have the option to buy, to convert, the bridge, to send, and to receive. So if you choose the option that says convert, you can choose the maximum amount. And here into the active, what you can do is to change it into the token that you're actually looking for. Now, depending on the country you are living, you might be having uh, different elements available into your store and, of course, not available. So for example, if I wanted to send this directly into USD, I am not able to do this directly in here. I need, of course, to choose a different network in order to do it so. But um, once you have selected the actual token, just hit now into continue. And once you have that asset, what you can do is to hit into send and choose to withdraw your money with your banking account. Now, depending here, if you have the cash out section, in this case, this is not appearing the cash out initiation process. So you don't have to worry about that because what we can do is to look out for another crypto wallet that can be helping us to do this process. So in my case, I found an actual application called Betso. Betso is available into my store. It's available into my actual country and it has the currency that runs to my actual banking account. So what I needed to do, of course, is to choose the token that I do have directly into Coinbase wallet. So I go back here into Coinbase wallet and I go for send. I choose the maximum amount. I choose my ether and I go for next. Now it's going to be, of course, asking you to add the address of the receiver. So back into your uh, other crypto wallet, I'm going to locate the token I would like to receive. In my case, it would be the AI. So I locate it and I go for the option that says deposit. So I choose the crypto network, which in this case is Ethereum ERC20, and I select it. Now here, as you can see, here's my user wallet. And here, there's no fee, actually. So what I just need to do is to copy this DAI and paste it right in here in order for receiving my actual cryptos. Once I have made the process of the transfer, what I can do now is to, of course, make the conversion between my DAI new token and the currency that my bank is going to be receiving. So let's go and choose, for example, this option. Choose the token you have just received it and choose the currency that you're going to be receiving into your banking account, which in this case is Mexican peso. So this is the amount that you are going to be having. This is the amount that you get into your banking account. Once you done this process, just hit into continue. And then you have now your actual money into Betso, in this case, converted into MXN. What is left for me to do is to send this actual token directly inside a banking account. I choose to banking account, and as you can see here is Mexico Bank Transfer. So I choose this option. I choose how many I want to send and where it is, for example, from a bit of transfer or a banking account. So once I make the deposit, 
I might be having my money already been set up directly into my banking account. Lastly, you want to wait for the process. After confirming the withdrawal, Coinbase might be processing your request, and in this case, Betso, so you might want to wait between one one to five business days depending on the banking process times. And lastly, just verify that the deposit appears now directly into your banking account and then you're actually good to go, guys. And that is actually it. You have now, guys, successfully withdrawn your money from the Coinbase wallet to your banking account or even you have the actual Bitso wallet account. There are several crypto wallets that you can find online, but try to find one that actually has the actual cryptocurrency that allows your banking account to make the process much more faster. So guys, thank you so much for watching. If you found this story helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and share this video. Stay tuned to online media for more informative guides and tutorials. Until next time.